The party is here! Oh, oh, Welcome oh, to Holly oh, Scoops, oh, Jeff oh. Sayin. I'm Madison Hill. I'm Madison Conklin. Obviously, if you couldn't tell, we are talking about the Jersey Shore, Shore. Florabama debacle that's happening right now. So MTV announced they are going to reboot in a way yeah. MTV's Jersey Shore with a whole new cast and new show premise. They're actually calling it the next Shore thing. So they're definitely playing off the Jersey Shore, the duck phone's gonna be back, beach, tan, Gym laundry, tan laundry, all that's all gonna it. be going on, <laughs> except not with the original cast. And it's, it's gonna be all new people. And it's not in New Jersey, it's actually called Florabama Shore, which is Alabama, Florida, borderline. Right. I think it actually takes place in Florida, but they, they're calling it Florabama Shore. So right. it's pretty much the southern, Version. Redneck version of Guido Jersey Shore. And Absolutely. I am all for it because let's be real. The OG cast of Jersey Shore, two of them have kids, half of them are married. Mike, the situation is sober, and he was the most outlandish, crazy one besides Dina, Snooki, and JWoww. But for the guys, he was kind of like the instigator. He can't get into that because you know what happens when he starts drinking and doing drugs. It gets out of control. Well, Maddie, like me well, and <laughs> the rest of a lot of people on Twitter, we disagree with you. The OG cast needs to come back. They're the ones who made the Jersey Shore. They will be the ones who to continue the legacy. And Mike, the situation kind of kicked things off. The cast has just been going off on Twitter, calling out MTV, being like, if you're going to remake the Jersey Shore, we're the ones who made it we should be the ones coming back. Okay, so out. hold they, on, wait, let me tell you what they said. Okay. So Mike The Situation tweeted and he was like, um, retweet, uh, you heard the people MTV, just bring back the real Jersey Shore, retweet if you agree. The whole cast retweeted. And then like you were saying, they're old, blah, blah. Well, Snooki took to Twitter to disparage those rumors. And she said, hilariously, quote, I'm 29, two kids, married, and can still funnel wine and do cartwheels on the dance floor. We aren't dead, Bundy. Okay. Okay. I can agree with her because I've seen her Snapchat. She does still turn <laughs> up. She's a little nugget bouncing around. But does anyone remember that last season of Jersey Shore when she was pregnant with Lorenzo and how boring she was? Like, no one wants to see that. How can they leave their kids for months at a time? They can't. Well, it Jay would Howe, have to look differently. It would be a little different. I think they would then somehow. Then it wouldn't be the OG. I'm sorry. It would not be the OG. Somehow they would have to incorporate their lives. But I think. They are hilarious enough in their own right, and together they're hilarious. They just got back together for Dina's, uh, she just got married. Wedding. And of course, Ronnie wasn't there. Ronnie's the only one who's would throw a rink in this situation. He wasn't in the Burger King re like little reunion. He wasn't at Dina's wedding. Um, so he's the only one who I'm like, okay, maybe he's gonna throw a rink in the situation. But I think that it would still be hilarious with the original cast. They're the ones who made it. Okay, I, I'm not gonna disagree because the, the original cast is really hysterical. They coined it GTL, cabs are here, like <laughs> all of that. But this is how TV goes, this is how reality TV goes. Not every real world of MTV has been the same cast because they need new blood, they need new drama, they need new storylines and background stories of different people. We know the Jersey Shore cast, but they have all retired their Jersey Shore days. So bring in a new, different location, different area, different attitudes, different ways right. of life, and reboot the day. I guess thing. I would be okay with the reboot if they weren't playing so much off of Jersey Shore and making it seem like this is gonna be the next Jersey Shore. If they were just like, hey, we have this new group of kids, these new people, it's gonna be in Florabama. Literally, the promo pictures are the exact same. Be same font, same posing, everything. Because it's the franchise. They're going off the Jersey Shore franchise. And yeah, maybe it's been a couple years and maybe they should have followed up right away. Mm -hmm. But that's like, again, with the real world, the challenge. Seven strangers picked to live in a house. That's the <laughs> franchise and every season is a different cast, a different character, a different city. It's it's just the franchise. So OG Jersey Shore people, we love you, but get over it. You're old now, no offense. You've got your own lives, you got your own companies. Let some new blood in. Let's get some new faces famous for being idiotic and stupid and drunk on TV. I'm okay. for the OG. Okay. The OGs made it, they should come Girl, back. But goodbye. you guys, we wanna know what you guys <laughs> think. Are you for an OG Jersey Shore reunion? Or are you feeling this Florabama new shore thing? I'm saying no, I'm Maddie's saying, saying yes. yes. Tell us what you guys think down there in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you here tomorrow on Holly Scoops Just Saying. Bye guys. <laughs>